I've come today to all crop fisheries, I've chose what we believe is one of the snaggiest pegs or the most features on the complex. I've done this purposely so I could put my margin fishing and my edge kit through its paces, make sure it's all up to scratch, there's nothing to chance, just make sure everything is absolutely tuned to perfection. I've had to use a really robust kit today to catch these fish. This is my setup, what I've used. I've been using a 14 to 16 zip. There is a heavier one, but I've started on this and it just, just gives me that choice to go up to this one if I need to. But I've found this one's been absolutely perfect. I've coupled it with a 412 stilt, 021 main line, down to a 019 bottom, a 12 hook, and I've got a little, isn't bunched together bulk but it's not strung out it's not fully strung out i've probably got 10 mil in between each style just allows it to rest on bottom and it doesn't sit in a big thick bulk just slowly sits on bottom allows me to read my bites a little bit better today my feeding and my peg choice and my area of my peg how i've gone about it to my left hand side i've got considerably less depth than to my right hand side so to my left hand side i've fed ground bait I fished two worms over the top, one worm broke in two, two pieces of sweet corn. I fed ground bait there with it being shallow because it allows me to see the fish. I know they're going to blow the ground bait all around my peg, but I can keep looking down and it's shallow enough for me to see the tail, see the fish, see the walking around. To my right hand side, it's way, way deeper. I'm fishing a little bit off the reeds because I can't fully get around the corner. Snags, brambles, twigs. Because it's a lot deeper, I don't want to feed ground bait there. I feel the fish, if I had a fed ground bait, would have blown it all around and I couldn't tell where they were. So I've fed my crows, I've fished double sweet corn, single sweet corn, or a bunch of red maggots over the top. I potted in, it's allowed me to concentrate my bait where I want the fish. I want them facing that way to my bait. If I'd have fed ground bait there and they'd have blown it over a couple of metres, I could be getting the tails hitting line, the heads, the fins, by just potting amounts of bait in, going over the top, I've concentrated my fish and that's how I've caught them to my right. 